So now let us consider this third problem. So here we have to compute uh, the integral minus pi to pi x square plus cos x and delta of uh, minus pi x, right? Okay, now see here we have delta of minus pi x. So we'll make use of one important property of Dirac delta function, uh, which says that uh, delta of ax is equal to uh, one over absolute value of a uh, and here we have delta of x right where a is uh, not equal to uh, 0 right so delta of uh, minus pi x can be written as with the help of this property a is our minus pi right a is minus pi so we have 1 over mod of minus pi and here we have delta of x and mod of minus pi is 1 over pi right so the absolute value function it makes it positive so here we have delta of x right so now this integral can be written as minus pi to pi here we have x square plus cos x and here we have 1 over pi uh, delta of x and dx so now we can take 1 over pi outside the integral we have minus pi to pi x square plus cos x and delta of x can be written as delta of x minus 0 right so this is an important point here so delta x can be written as delta of x minus 0 so see here the limits uh, are from minus pi to pi and this point that is uh, a a is equal to 0 it uh, lies between minus pi and pi right so here we have 0 so the value of the delta function it exists only at this point right that is a is equal to 0 because a is equal to 0 fall within minus pi and pi right so now if we take this function as f of x and this as delta of x minus a then the value of this integral is equal to uh, the value of this function at this point that is f of 0 that is f of a so we can now write 1 over pi f of 0 right because we have the definition minus infinity to infinity f of x delta of x minus a dx is equal to uh, f of a right so the value of this integral may be computed by uh, evaluating the value of the function f of x at this point a and here the point a is 0 and f of x is x square plus cos x right so now we have 1 over pi and f of 0 uh, can be obtained by taking x is equal to 0 in this function so we have 0 square then we have cos of 0 so we have now 1 over pi uh, 0 uh, 0 square is 0 and cosine 0 is 1 so we have 1 over pi times 1 that is 1 over pi right so the value of this uh, integral is equal to 1 over pi So now let us consider this fourth problem. So here uh, we have to compute this integral from 0 to infinity e raised to minus t times cosine 2t divided by pi and uh, delta of t minus pi. Right. Okay. Now see uh, here the limits of integration are from 0 to infinity. So here we have 0. Here we have infinity and this point is our uh, point a so we have delta of t minus a right so here we have a is equal to pi so the value of the Dirac delta function it exists only at this point right so the spike it exists only at a is equal to pi and except a is equal to pi the value of direct uh, Dirac delta function is zero uh, at all other points right so here uh, we can take uh, this function 
as f of t right so now our integral reads as 0 to infinity then we have f of t and then we have delta of t minus a and then we have dt and remember a is uh, equal to pi right and again uh, we'll make use of this definition that is uh, the integral minus infinity to infinity f of t delta of t minus a uh, dt is equal to the value of the function at this point a that is f of a right so here uh, the point a it lies between 0 and infinity so the value of this integral is simply the value of this function at this point a right so we have f of pi because a is equal to pi and now uh, f of t is this function e raised to minus t cos 2t over pi so let us take uh, t is equal to pi in this expression that is uh, e raised to minus t cos 2t over pi so we have e then we have minus uh, pi then we have cos of 2 pi divided by pi so now uh, this pi and this pi get cancelled and we are left with e raised to minus the cos of 2 pi right and we know that cos of 2 pi is equal to positive 1, right? So we have e raised to minus, here we have plus 1. So we have e raised to minus 1, that is equal to 1 over e, right? So where's the value of this integral is equal to uh, 1 over e.